Hi friends, I'm D Vegan. I want to make a green salad today. I try to make one every day because greens are the healthiest food and I love it. Quick, I have a made dressing here, pre-made dressing. Cashew cream dressing, very easy. Just cashews, lemons, dates, uh, Himalayan salt and chili pepper, chili powder, a little bit of water. And you can watch how to make this video in a video in another video that is linked under this video you're watching right now. It's nice to have a pre-made dressing because you can make a quick and easy salad in no time. And it can also be different every day. So the greens have to be for me, that's important. And I have a, a frise here, it's called a kind of lettuce here. I just took some leaves off the head, washed them, dried them in a, in a salad spinner, and I just tear them apart like that. Uh, that is so these tender leafy greens. It's a nice way to get them into bite-sized pieces, you see. It can be a little bit larger because they are so tender. You can put them easily into the mouth. It may, it's nice because they have the freshness is maybe the nicest thing of a green lettuce. Uh, the lettuce is not fresh anymore. It really loses all its beauty, its flavor. It has to be fresh. And to keep it fresh, um, you have uh, big pieces, so that it's not so light, not so easy to to uh, mash them together. When they're too small, it can easily mash together. So that's nice just to tear apart. And then I have a green that is an interesting. I use this green oftentimes as a seasoning in a salad. This is arugula, also called rocket, and it's a very strong flavor. It grows like uh, like a weed in the garden. It's super healthy. It has a little bit of sharp flavor. Um, by itself, you can eat it all in the salad by itself. Some people like that a lot. But anyway, it's also nice um, just as a seasoning. It makes the, the gentle flavor of the lettuce, the tender leafy green, makes it a little bit more savory. And that's nice. So I put it here and there. There's just some, just a handful of leaves here of a arugula. And with arugula together, perfect are tomatoes always. They are perfect with arugula. You can make an arugula salad just with tomatoes. And I have here some cupped tomatoes, some cherry tomatoes, and together with the tomatoes, always very nice, some onions. That would be a perfect salad by itself. Just here, the green tomatoes and onions. And then I add two more ingredients because I want to have a little bit more, um, more nourishing. Uh, some fatty ingredients here, both fruit, botanically, it's green olive. You can take any kind of olive and an avocado here. Avocados and olives also very nice together with tomatoes, also fruit by the way, onions, lettuce, also all classic combinations, all classic ingredients for salads. Very nice and very easy to have. Yeah. <clears throat> and now I put the dressing on top and that's it. I show you the dressing. You know, I have a dressing. Um, every so often I make a new one. This is my latest one. And then I make a batch or two, or then next day another one. So I have always something at, ha at hand in the refrigerator. It takes about, it keeps about four days or so, then I would make another new one because then at a certain point it turns sour and I wouldn't take it anymore then. Maybe not. So, but, but um, it's easy with these kinds of, of dressings here to make a new salad. And also you can vary. A new dressing is a new salad. You know, and this, especially when the dressing is um, nutritious like this, with cashews in there, then you have a nutritious dressing. This is so easy. Dates, so very nutritious. Very simple. I will toss it only directly before I eat it. <clears throat> Otherwise, the earlier I toss a lettuce with tender leafy greens, the earlier it loses its crunch. Yeah. So I only toss it like this before I eat it. So but you see already, it's so nice and it's super delicious. You can't go wrong with this kind of salad. Very easy to make. You have a nice dressing, it has to taste good, and then some easy fitting ingredients. There we go. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy. If you like, like my video, subscribe and be vegan on YouTube. Have another recipe every single day and find me on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest and Twitter.